now the real work starts. I'm gonna video our morning routine. Go, both of us got our coffee made. I'm cold. You can and... clearly see she has a jacket on inside. Yes. So odd. Yes. I'm in a, I don't know, long sleeve shirt, but it's thin. It is like 28 degrees outside this morning in Texas. So. I think it's, I think we deserve a fire. So we found a quick, easy way. We thought we'd show you um, kind of the best way to get a fire going. I don't think this is like any rocket science. Obviously, safety first for everybody out here. And, you know, we are not responsible for <laughs> you catching something on fire. Listen, just be cautious and know that this is a redneck way of starting a fire. But it works. It'll be ready in like minutes. Redneck? I prefer Southern Gentleman. <laughs> okay. okay, we'll start with that, Southern Gentleman. The first thing you need is firewood. So we got this firewood stacked here. Obviously, wherever your stash is, go grab your firewood. Just saying, if you can see your breath outside, it's cold. Okay. okay. This isn't, again, rocket science, but if you don't know how to build a fire, it's a, a how-to video inside a how-to video. How about that? So usually, like kindling small, like burnable stuff that's gonna burn fast. You wanna put that on the bottom. So here we go, some tree bark, smaller, thin, thinner pieces of wood with a little bit bigger on top. And then you kinda just, same deal, you build sort of a you know, TP, whatever fun shape you wanna get. There and show them what my creation looks like. I like videoing by myself. Oh, Addy likes it too. What's in there, girl? Are oh, you gonna close it? Good, Good job. job. Sometimes when you're doing these chores, you gotta put the baby in baby prison, AKA the high chair. Eating crackers. So she can have a snack and not bug you to death. <laughs> All right, best 40 to $50 you can spend this winter, almost guaranteed if you have a fireplace, is a propane torch. It attaches to a propane tank. Always store this outside, not in the house, right? And it can go boom, but um, it's amazing. Let's start this fire. Before we get going with the way, the only other way I've ever been taught to start a fire is like these burning logs. They're kind of cool, but man, they suck. <laughs> it's just, they take forever to get going. You're gonna need a lighter. So, but again, it's pretty straightforward. You turn on the propane here. There is a valve here that lets you control how much propane comes out. I always have it closed, but you can hear it starting to pour out. Again, safety first. But I never use this little handle. I'll show you what it does. It gives you a squirt and it's really hard to control. So I never ever use that. I use the dial in and increase the flow there. But essentially that's it. Turn this down so y'all can hear me. But again, the goal here is just to show you a super simple, easy way to start a fire, indoor, outdoor. We use this on the porch if we have a bunch of people coming over and our, our propane starter takes a little bit to build. We'll go, you know, hit the wood with this to get it, get it going. But super awesome tool, super awesome way to build really any indoor, outdoor fire. Hope you guys enjoy this. If you do, subscribe for some more how-to videos similar to this. Take care, thanks for tuning in.